The road to GH will reveal the story of Ingo Rademacher and his lawsuit against ABC, which has become a point of interest in the entertainment industry, especially after he claimed he was treated unfairly and politically discriminated against. After being fired from General Hospital for not complying with the network's COVID-19 vaccination policy, Rademacher filed a lawsuit against ABC, though the initial case was dismissed. However, he did not give up and continued to appeal. In his latest moves, he has even brought Steve Burton, his co-star, who was also fired for the same reason, into the case. Specifically, Rademacher's legal strategy focuses on criticizing ABC's decision to bring Burton back to the show in his role as Jason Morgan, despite Burton also being fired for not complying with the vaccination requirement. Rademacher's lawyer argues that Burton's reinstatement is proof that ABC's actions were politically motivated, and that this is clear discrimination against Rademacher. According to Rademacher's attorney, ABC's decision to bring Burton back confirms that they let Ingo go because they didn't like his political views. While Burton was reinstated, Ingo was completely let go, and they even planned to replace his role with another actor. Rademacher's legal team asserts that if not complying with the vaccination requirement was the sole reason for termination, Rademacher should have been given the same opportunity to return as Burton. Although ABC argues that Burton's reinstatement is unrelated to Rademacher's issue and claims the decision was simply a producer's choice based on the character of Jason, the difference in how the two actors were treated has raised suspicions of political bias. Rademacher believes he was let go because of his differing political views, something he believes was unfair. In a bold move, Rademacher and his lawyer requested that the court reopen the summary judgment proceedings and review new documents including text messages between general hospital producers that Rademacher believes show political discrimination. These new pieces of evidence, according to Rademacher's lawyer, demonstrate that ABC acted improperly when deciding to let him go. Although the request to reopen the discovery process was denied in a recent hearing, the lawsuit is still ongoing and will continue to be closely monitored in the coming weeks. Rademacher is determined to pursue the case, hoping for fairness in the court's decision. Rademacher also decided to reveal some unexpected truths about relationships in the entertainment industry and how producers sometimes treat actors who aren't considered big stars unfairly. He mentioned that he had witnessed situations where certain actors were favored, while others had to endure indifference and even exploitation to the point where they couldn't continue on the show. You think we're all good friends supporting each other in this work? No, Ingo began, his gaze heavy. There are people you think will always be there for you, but when the spotlight fades, you realize only the real stars are treated fairly. He referred to Sam McCall, a character played by Kelly Monaco. According to Rademacher, Sam's departure wasn't a simple decision, but the result of several external factors. Sam wasn't in favor with the powerful people at GH anymore. She wasn't their top pick. Decisions aren't always based on acting ability but sometimes on the support from producers and big stars, Ingo said. When someone falls out of favor with the powers that be, they'll find a way to push them off the show. Rademacher continued to reveal that there had been other former actors in similar situations, having to leave because they couldn't endure the harsh working conditions and lack of recognition. In addition, Ingo also accused the industry of frequently unfair treatment of actors. He recounted instances where he saw his colleagues having to accept poor working conditions, from not being properly acknowledged, to being excluded from important scenes. Some people get left behind, because they're not the shining stars. You see them on screen, but behind the scenes, they're just a nobody treated like a pawn, Rademacher revealed. Finally, he emphasized that although General Hospital might be a great workplace for some, for those not considered key pieces, it can feel like being exploited. Being taken advantage of in this industry isn't something unusual. When you're no longer an irreplaceable part of the show, you're just a shadow, Rademacher shared. These revelations from Ingo Rademacher not only sparked a wave of controversy among fans, but also shed light on the darker sides of General Hospital, where the careers and lives of actors are not always as bright as what viewers see on screen.